aka home garden guys today i'm gonna give you a look and a taste test of my black cream tomatoes when i was researching apparently this is one of the best tasting tomatoes i must admit i had a few already before i even got the chance to do the review for you guys because they started wrapping up so quickly and i didn't get around to do the video so i'm going to do the video today for you guys i had a couple well i bought the seeds and they did germinate properly so some ripe and i have i think it's six plants in total and guys some of the reviews says that it doesn't produce a lot but like this is one vine here I harvest two from this one already there's some more here coming through and it goes up it goes up and it goes up so this tomato plant actually produces a lot and it goes straight up into the ceiling then i have some more over there guys and i have some more over here so i do have a lot of um black cream tomatoes because the review was really really good and i wanted some nice tasting tomatoes because my boys are not the biggest fans of tomatoes so i'm trying to incorporate some nicer taste ones in the garden and they're over there so i got the pictures i have a lot and they're producing heavily for me at the moment so i'm gonna harvest these ripe one i'm gonna have these today guys with some kalaloo that i harvest yesterday so i'm gonna harvest these i'm gonna take them inside cut them open so you can see what they look like okay so harvest them and take them indoor guys when i opened these wasn't what i expect so i'm not gonna take i'm not gonna let the surprise go away i'm gonna take them and cut them with you so you can see what it looks like so i'm gonna use all of these today it doesn't matter if i harvest them properly or not i'm not gonna store them i'm just gonna use them in my meal and while i'm here i'm just gonna harvest these because i need some tomatoes for the kalaloo so i'm gonna take it indoor and i'm gonna open so these are there as well but i'm not gonna talk about those so i'm just focusing on my black cream tomatoes so i'm gonna go in and then do a taste test for you guys guys this is now two days after i harvest the black cream tomatoes so i have loads more i did eat some guys i was so busy to do this second part of the video so i just get in the second part of the video so guys look at my beautiful color contrast on my black cream tomato so i have different size these are this is not even the largest one guys i have some really large one medium one i even have a smaller one guys these are so pretty so i have like a darkish burgundy reddish color really nice 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 tomato and guys yes i did say i couldn't wait so i did try them but i'm not gonna tell you exactly what it tastes like yet i'm gonna open it cut it cut into it so you can see oh guys these guys are so good i cut into this one guys so you can see what it look like i'm a knife dull as usual guys i need to sharpen them this one is super ripe mm, 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 mm. guys these things are so juicy look at it beautiful beautiful contours look at it. it's beautiful beautiful so this is my black cream tomato guys let's try it. the skin is so thin you can literally just peel it off like that so so thin just like that it's like it's like a fruit guys it's literally like a fruit if you don't like the skin you can just literally peel it off and it just come off like that really nice nice thin very thin skin so let's try it for you guys the flavor so intense it is so juicy it's really really nice 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 flavor sweet taste to it you don't have the tartness like some of the tomatoes you don't have the tartness like some some tomorrow this is really and this is it's not acidic at all not very acidic and the plant the plant grow more than seven feet tall guys i have to be topping the tops out these grow so much 
and it produces so much because what happened because it's a heirloom tomato I did not cut all the size shoes like I do with most of the tomatoes I just allow it to grow so I could see how much it will produce so in the early part where the plant was very short I cut all the size shoes because I wanted to grow up and the fruit not to be touching the ground and things like that but after that I just let the size shoot and everything grow and I'm telling you this tomato does produce a good amount of tomatoes so I'm pleased with it so yes guys I would definitely grow these tomato again every year very sweet tasting super juicy delicious tomato so guys at the moment I try not to cook with them they're so sweet I just put them in salad guys because I cook with them but I try not to I try to reserve them for salad my husband did try them and say it actually tastes like a fruit it does have a good fruity taste to it so let me know in the comment section I can cut another one for you let me know in the comment section if you're growing this variety before and if you like it so this one is less ripe so you can see the middle more versus a very very ripe one so the middle is totally red so you can see guys it's so pretty I think it's super pretty so let me know if you have tried this variety of tomato before let me know if you like it guys I do like it and these are ear loans so I'll be saving my seeds and grow them on next year so that's my taste test guys until next time keep gardening and for my beautiful plate of tomatoes to yours see you on the next upload take care now bye bye like share subscribe and click the notification bell